Holy crap, I'm in Fortnite! What's going on everybody? We're back with another slop video and boy is today a sloppy day. So not only did we get a release date for the GTA 6 trailer, but we also got Eminem in Fortnite, along with some extremely fake GTA 6 leaks. So let's get right into the slop, Epic Gamers. So yesterday Rockstar made a tweet announcing that the very first trailer for GTA 6 will be dropping Tuesday, December 5th at 9am Eastern Time. Which in my opinion I think is a pretty weird time to drop the trailer for the most hyped game of all time. And that statement in itself feels like I'm selling GTA 6 short. We all know how fucking big this game is gonna be when it drops. Anytime a new GTA gets announced, it's the biggest thing for at least like three years. So it just seems weird to post this video that you know is gonna break the internet for at least a short amount of time. At a time where most people are in work or school, it just feels like this trailer could have been dropped at such a better time. Even if they just dropped the trailer later on in the day or on the weekend, it would be 10 times better. But I digress, I'm not gonna sit here and reiterate all the points most critical made in his video. But that's not it for GTA 6 news because apparently the trailer and the map for GTA 6 got leaked on Twitter. Now obviously I can't show the quote unquote map leaks because I can't tell if that's real or not, but what I can tell is that this leaked GTA trailer is complete bullshit. Now this hasn't been the only time we've seen GTA 6 leaks, actually a couple of months ago we got real game footage leak, leaks that actually had people playing the game in the game world going inside of stores and shit like that, but again I'm not going to show that because I don't need Rockstar to kill me, but I can 100% without a doubt show this fake ass trailer. because. It's so blatant that all you would need to do is watch the Need for Speed trailer and the Watch Dogs 2 trailer and basically you've watched this GTA 6 trailer. It's all just scenes from both of those games put into one and you could see it so fucking clearly they don't try to hide it at all. You could literally go and watch both of these trailers right now once you're done watching the video by the way. So I feel like this goes without saying but please don't send any hate to the person who made this trailer. Even if it's clearly just made to get dumbasses like me to click on it. No matter the case I don't want to try to send any hate their way I'd rather just make fun of their clear fake trailer and then just move on. So there's no reason to turn this into anything bigger than it is. But moving on from clearly fake trailers, the Eminem Fortnite event happened this morning. I didn't get to see it myself because my sleep schedule has been horrible the past week, but it doesn't seem like I missed much. But since I wasn't able to record it, enjoy Nick A30's reaction. <laughs> So it seems like they combined a bunch of stuff from OG Fortnite for the initial start of the event, then showed a bunch of other games that Epic Games currently owns, like Fall Guys, Rocket League, and um, Lego. Yeah, so apparently the next season of Fortnite is going to have Lego characters in it, and Mario Kart style racing. So it seems like Fortnite's actually trying to make somewhat of a comeback like they did with OG Fortnite, or at least try to preserve all the people who are still playing right now. Will it actually be anything compared to the hype that the OG season brought? Probably not. Who knows, I guess we'll just wait and see. Since the event, there's been two Twitter accounts that I know of that have been created for this whole Rocket League and Lego Fortnite collab. It's like the Monster Mash, but instead of monsters, it's Epic Games. So yeah, basically the same thing. But a Lego Fortnite account made a tweet saying that Lego Fortnite will be available on December 7th, and the Rocket League account announced that Rocket Racing would be available in Fortnite December 8th. And talking about the actual Eminem event, it was pretty cool, you know, as somebody who used to listen to Eminem before he was garbage. It was nice seeing the beginning of the event and the concert with older Eminem and then having you play like a Guitar Hero style rhythm game. And then it got really shit because they tried to recreate the Travis Scott event, making everything around you all colorful and all over the place like a utopia. But then they used a recent Eminem song and it just went all downhill from there. But yeah, that's pretty much it for all the stuff that happened today. The uh, new season for Fortnite will probably be dropping on like December 5th, somewhere around that time. And we already have confirmation that the GTA 6 trailer drops Tuesday, 9 a.m. December 5th. So who knows, maybe we'll get the GTA 
GTA 6 trailer and the new Fortnite season in the same day. Which in all honesty, I am kind of excited for both. I haven't played Fortnite since Chapter 2 Season 4 when I used to go for trick shots and thought that I was cool. But I came back during the OG season and I had a blast using weapons that I haven't used in literal years. As well as seeing a map that I still know like the back of my hand. It was so cool being able to be on a map that I haven't been on in years and still know where certain chests are and houses. As well as just being able to relive some classic memories. I genuinely like enjoyed Fortnite for the first time in a long time. And I hope that the new season can bring that enjoyment back in some form. Which it does look promising. I mean, yeah, they're just using stuff from our childhoods to get us to play it. But you're gonna tell me that you're not gonna play Lego Fortnite while also playing Rocket League Mario Kart at the same time? But anyway, that's it for this slop video. If you enjoyed, be sure to like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, bye.